What's up guys, it's Matt, and today I will be bringing you a channel update. Yes, that's right guys, a channel update video. Well, when I say video, I really mean just a nice image on the background on the video which says channel update. So feel free to, you know, minimize the uh, video. Well, it's technically just an audio, but yeah, feel free to minimize and, you know, browse the web, go on Facebook or Twitter or, you know what, just do what you want, I suppose, or you can just watch it even though it's just a picture file or picture file ah! what am I saying a, a a text file a text file no it's not a text file idiot what am I saying it's a um I should say it's an image it's an image guys okay it's an image saying channel update and yeah so you can feel free to do what you want you can I know look at it I suppose or you can minimize it so yes yeah, so um enjoy okay guys so in this video I'd like to talk to you guys about What's happening with the channel? Why haven't I been uploading videos lately? What's going on? And we miss you. Okay, thank you guys for missing me. But yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so um, let's first off, why haven't I been uploading videos? Okay, well, um, simply because I got my A-level results and like I'm going to university, so I've got all the, you know, enrollment to do and all that stuff. And you'd be saying, but it really took a month to do that? No, you're right. But um, let me just talk about my university and stuff. Okay, so what, in my A-levels, I got yeah, people who don't know what, if you're outside England. I think A-levels just for UK, but anyway, for people who don't know what A-levels are, um, they're literally like, they're like, well, what's, the, what's the best way to say it, really? It's like a, basically, it's a grade where, it's like GCSEs, if you know what GCSEs are. And it's just a harder version, like it's more in-depth. But anyway, basically, what A-levels are is you need them to go to university or to study further education. So, there you go, simple terms. Okay, so um, I got three A's, which is good. And the, the most, the highest you can get is A-stars. So, I didn't get three A-stars, but I got three A's, which is still good. So, it was uh, 360 UCAS points, so it's good enough to get into my university. Now, um, my university is pretty local, it's only an hour away, so instead of me... Staying over there, I'll be um, either driving there or getting the train, so I can still stay at home, do YouTube and all that stuff, so it'll be pretty good. And um, what am I studying? Well, I'm studying computer science, so it should be pretty good, to be honest, studying computer science, so yeah. Okay, so, um, got out of the way, so what else are you uh, planning to do? Okay, so what else I'll like, like to plan to do is, um, okay, so what, what is going on exactly is that, since I've been, you know, I've been doing stuff with university and stuff, um, saying goodbye to friends and all that stuff, you may be asking why you're not uploading any videos. It's not exactly hard. Well, lately I've been, you know, if you know me for a long time, I like to do quality and I like to get the best, be uh, get the best products out, get the best products out. What am I saying? Like buy the best, best, <laughs> buy the best products. You know, buy the be the best like recording setup and all that stuff. So, um, as you may guys may have known, I recorded with the Black Magic Intensity Pro. Fantastic. Except the last two or three months when I was recording, it would drop frames. And even though the program like you can tick a box where it says stop capture if frames are dropped. But the thing is, though, the program didn't pick it up, but I saw it. Like, I could tell the difference if it was dropping frames or not. So, I looked into research, and it was all about disk speed, because you need, like, a RAID setup with a Blackmagic. So, I thought, okay. So, I brought two new hard drives for £200. Well, they're, like, £95, but including postage. So, £200. I set up a RAID setup, and it was a lot faster. And the, you know, the, um, the frame rate, the lat, like, the dropping was still slightly there but it was better and I could live with it but then you know I was talking to myself and as I do I like to talk to myself and um, I was like okay so um if you think about it like I can only record in 720p or 1080i now if you guys know 720p is better than 1080i and 1080p is better than 1080i because it just is and if you don't know the difference between 1080i and 720p 1080i is the same as 720p, but just stretch. So that's why it's 1080i is only better if you're watching like films, like low frames per second, compared to um, like if you were going to play like Call of Duty or like a game which is fast frames per second. So like 720p would be quicker because it's smaller, 
pixels and, it, and it's like a lot quicker, the same quality. Whereas 1080p is the same as 720p, but it has this more pixels, so 192 by 1080. So the same as 1080i, but it has the progression, which is the P stands for. It sounds like performance, I think, as well. So it's a lot quicker. So 1080p is the best. So I was thinking, am I able to record in 1080p? Now I was looking, and I looked at a few Blackmagic products, because I actually like adore their products. But um, unfortunately, I would have needed to buy a new computer. And my computer at the moment is really good. Like, I've just purchased a MacBook Pro, so the new ROM and Retina display, fantastic. Fantastic laptop, by the way, guys. And I was saying, I don't really need a new c computer yet. So I was thinking, what can I get? You know, like, instead of internal, I was going to go for an external, like, external capture card again. Because just in case if I go to a friend's house or I'm doing something, like, where I'm not by my computer, I can at least plug it to my MacBook and still do, like, Call of Duty videos. So, um... Yes, so I turned to, I was doing some research, and I turned to the Elgato Capture Card HD, and um, it's the same size as an iPhone, really. It's HDMI in, HDMI out, which I wanted. I don't really want component cables, as the quality does downgrade. So I use HDMI in, HDMI out, it does. I can play in 1080p, and I can record in 1080p, so all my gaming videos from now on will be in 1080p, so that's why I chose it. Great capture card, it costs £160. It's pretty worth it. People say, is it better than a PVR? If you're using an Xbox, then yes. If you use a PS3, obviously, you've got then use the component cables. And then, personally, I would prefer to use the Elgato because you can then play in 1080p and record in 1080p. So, yeah, so it's pretty good. Also, I'd like to add on to that is um, I purchased a new microphone. Now, I have I used to have three or four microphones, but I've now sold them because, obviously... If you're like on YouTube or whatever, you want to get better quality, and obviously when you buy microphones, they just stand around, stand around, you know, they just lay around doing nothing. So I sold uh, quite a lot of them on eBay, and I made some decent money out of them. So, you know, I thought I'd buy myself a good microphone, and this, this, this is sort of like the setup I've always wanted, really. It's um, a boom stand, so it's connected to the desk, and obviously you can move the boom stand, so you can move it forward, left, right, up and down really good. And then it has the, a shock mount, so if the microphone does like move, it you, doesn't pick up the sound, which is really good. And then it has the microphone itself, which is a new microphone I brought, I and mean, I brought a massive pop shield for it as well. And it's great because I can move it around, I can do live commentaries more like easily, and more. So it basically just it's more flexible to, really to use really. And overall, it costs about two hundred and fifty pounds, which is quite expensive, but the microphone costs about one hundred and forty pounds. The pop shield cost £30. The shock mount cost, I think, 55 No, the shock mount cost about £35, £40. And then the, and then the boom stand cost maybe, I think it cost £89. So it's quite expensive, but like, I, I think it's pretty worth it. The quality is much better as well. It's called the Rode Podcaster because it's like a podcaster microphone. So, yeah. So, yeah. So that's what I've been buying. So I've been trying to buy better quality and, like... In capture card and you know microphones and all that kind of stuff so um now to the video side so i will be making more videos this video will be going up today on the um, 14th of the 9th which is a friday and that would be my channel update video and um, i haven't really told you what's happening to the channel so um i will be deleting quite a few videos simply because I haven't really, you know, like, been satisfied with all my, like, last few videos lately, and I thought, like, my year on YouTube video I did, it wasn't very good, really. I mean, personally, I really wouldn't watch it, so I've, I'm, like, you know, I'm going to take it down, take a few other videos down, which I didn't complete, like, the Modern Warfare 3 Double XP, I didn't complete the series at all, and for me, I'm the, I'm the like, my biggest critic is myself, so, like, if I see I haven't completed the series, and I just, like, turn, like, basically take it down because I don't want people to like you know think like okay this guy is very reliable for Modern Warfare 3 double XP announcements and when I don't do one I feel upset if I didn't do it or if I do know it's coming out and I don't do a video it's no point me making a video when it's already been done so yes yeah, so I'm taking down quite a few videos but I'm going to start fresh now um, what I'm going to be doing is what type of videos are coming out well I've got a series going on at the moment which I'm currently recording it's the uh, Modern Warfare 3 Road to Commander, and you may be asking yourselves, are you doing a Road to Commander on your new account, or an old account, or your current account? Now, before I get into that, 
a road to, a my Modern Warfare 3 Road to Commander is going to be pretty awesome. It's live comment. I'm like live commentating every single episode. It's going to be in 1080p, all great fancy graphics and all that stuff. But um, you may be asking, what is a Road to Commander if you don't know? So you basically go from Private, which is level 1 in Call of Duty, to level 80, which is a Commander. And what I would do is I record every game, I commentate, would live commentary every game. And you guys watch it so you, can, you guys can see how I play and etc. So it's a pretty good series at the start. Like, the first, I think, two hours in, um, I didn't realise I wasn't recording my friend's audio. So then I then changed it in the other episodes so you can hear my teammates' audio. And then I heard that you couldn't hear them loud enough, so now their voice is a lot louder. So hopefully it should turn out pretty good. But yes, yeah, so um, that's what's coming out of Road to Commander series. I'll probably be editing this on the weekend and start getting the episodes like out. Because what I don't want to happen, I believe it's going to be like 80 to 100 videos. And I've calculated it that if I upload one video a day... It will be past Black Ops release date, and obviously people won't watch Modern Warfare 3 gameplay after Black Ops, so it's obviously not the best idea to do it then. So I'll be uploading maybe two videos a day, and depending, you know, two videos of Road to Commander, and then like maybe three videos a week of other stuff like controller reviews, and maybe just some random gameplay like talking about life or talking about Black Ops 2. So yeah, so that's what will be coming in the future. Also, Minecraft, I've upgraded my Minecraft. Um, as you guys may know, you may not know, I really like, really enjoy Minecraft and I've just brought some new software to help me capture the, well basically I had the software before but I upgraded it to, um, to get better quality so I'll be doing Minecraft. I would try and, I try doing Minecraft in 1080p. It do, it lags a little bit but like I might as well just record it in 720p because that means it works best for everyone else and eventually if I do get a new computer then I will be doing Minecraft in 1080p but you know, Call of Duty in 1080p, Minecraft in 720p is pretty good still, so yeah. So Minecraft and Call of Duty coming out soon, some controller reviews and all that stuff, and yeah, so that's what's really happening. I'll be uploading this video, as I said, today, editing on the weekend, and making more videos in the week. Now, my target to get Black Ops 2 early, well, you know, that's going to be like... I, I, I have a few sources, like I'm getting the Prestige Edition, so, and that apparently... People who I'm buying it from normally, because it's, cause it's exclusive to them, I would normally get it on release day, which is kind of annoying. So um, I've got a few plans. I know a guy who um, who can probably get me Black Ops too early, like maybe two or three days, and drive to his house and buy it, buy it off him. Or I'm thinking of like I'm quite close with a company, which like is a retail shop. So maybe if I ask them, be like. Hey, if I pay you a hundred pound, double the price of the regular edition, is there any chance you could, you know, sell it to me? But I would love to get it Black Ops too early because since Modern Warfare Three came out, obviously I couldn't upload videos for a month because my internet connection decided to like just just die, and then so I had to buy a new internet connection, which is fantastic now. I'm on like a hundred and twenty megabits, but yes. Yeah, so um, Modern Warfare Three wasn't a great year for me, so yeah. So that's couldn't upload money gameplays at all, but yes. Yeah, so um. Hopefully I'll try and get Black Ops 2 early. I'll probably try and post a few videos if I get any more information about getting it early. But yes, yeah, so um, thank you guys for watching. If you're still here, that's amazing. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. And have a nice day, guys.